in today's video, I am putting myself in possibly the worst position someone has ever gone ahead and done so. Mukoko, one overall, one pace, one shooting, one passing, dribbling, defending, physicality, one star skill moves, and one star weak foot. What the hell are you doing? Today, we're taking on his career and trying to make him become the best player in world football, but not with natural growth. We are going to do it by going ahead and jumping into games ourselves. And we only get to play a maximum of five games per season and only the attacking highlights. So, depending on my performance on the pitch, on ultimate difficulty, with a one overall rated Mokoko to begin with, his ratings will go up. We're not bound to Borussia Dortmund. We can go to any team we want because obviously we want to lift the biggest trophy of them all by the end of this one. And I don't know, guys, but I feel like this is going to be the sickest challenge I've put ahead of myself in a long time. And here are the rules. While he is below the 50 rating, every single goal or assist gives him plus five overall. While he is from the 50 to the 80 rating, he is capable of growing plus three per goal or assist. And once we get to the 80, every goal or assist gets him a plus one only. So let's begin this absolutely mental journey that we're about to go on with Mukoko and his one overall on ultimate difficulty. Since I only get to pick and choose five games per season, I am going ahead and picking Mainz as the first opponent for Mukoko. I hope this is going to go well. I am hoping they give me a chance to step up and do something. And hopefully one day I can step into Champions League games and do well there. Mainz 05, here we go. I honestly don't know if this was a smart idea. This video is going to be filled with pain. 14th minute, first time I get to play with a one overall player. I think the smartest play would be to try and get an assist, right? So I, I honestly do believe at the beginning, that's what I need to do. So let's try and get the ball to Mukoko for him to just to play a simple freaking pass into someone who takes the shot like this. Jude, no, Jude, no, Jude. Don't do that to me. Hold on. The ball's still alive. No, what? How does he save that? Is he mental? That's it. First game, we were so close to getting the first overall boost, but I have failed miserably. Or should I say someone else failed miserably? Or should I say the goalkeeper was insane? I don't know what to say, but I have chosen Bochum as the next team that I want to play with or play against, I should say. 28th minute, Bochum is already leading and we get a chance with Mukoko to possibly run through the center. Go on, son. Power shot. It takes him half an hour. Yes. <laughs> Plus five. Plus five. Let's go. That will take him from one to six. I don't like that. I, I don't like that. I want to go to five. Let's go to five. All right. For the first one, we will go to plus five. There it is. First update. I've mostly gone for a little bit more pace and a little bit more shooting. Five overall. Next up, I've chosen an opponent in the cup and it is a second division club. So I'm hoping that this will be a little bit easier. Good ball. Daniel Malin. Inside, we have options. Good ball. One more. Yes. No. <laughs> it's a hit the crossbar. No. Well, only got to hit the crossbar and that's it. For game number four. I think it is game number four, right? I probably should write it down. We're playing against Augsburg. I think this could be all right. Jude. Okoko. I don't know what to do. We have the ball now in a good position. Inside. There he is. Shoot. <laughs> Shoot properly. Oh my God, bro. His shooting is so bad. Turns back. Pin. Yes. Do I get to take the pen? Yes, I do. Oh no. Oh no. Why do I get excited? A penalty for Mokoko. Oh my Lord. This is going to be so bad. I'm going to go down a center eyes. Center. Center. Bye. Have a great time. Oh, I didn't even give it the direction. Oh my God. I only have one game left for this season. For the final match of the season, I for some reason decided to go for a Champions League game. Yes, Copenhagen. I'm kind of hoping they are lower rated than any Bundesliga team. So this is it. 
Oh my god, I don't know what I'm doing. There's space. Go, go, go. Shoot. Shoot. Yes, assist. Get in. Mate. This is too intense. Every single moment feels like a Champions League final. That's it, guys. We have lost the game, but I couldn't care less. We're coming out of the season with 10 overall. Mukoko transfers to Australia. Yes, we are taking his talents to a lower league because obviously playing in the Bundesliga and also playing up there in the Champions League makes absolutely no sense. So a new chapter opens in Australia. I have a lot of viewers from Australia. Shout out to you guys. Good day, mate. Brisbane is the team we're going to. I'm ready to take on the A-League. Brisbane. Is that how you say it? Brisbane? Or do you say Brisbane as like Bane from Batman? Penalty for the first thing that Mukoko does. This is going to be great to watch. If the fans ever paid attention what their new transfer is capable of, this is all it is. I've gone with super low power this time. <laughs> and he still hits the post. It's the crossbar, I should say. Mate, I can't score a pen to save my life. What a horrible start into his career. One chance and one chance only. And it's a pen onto the crossbar. I need to get the job done now in this game, guys. Let's step it up, Mukoko, number nine. And we're already losing. Great. No pressure. Go on, son. Go on, son. Mukoko. Pen! Pen! Oh no! It's a pen again. Oh no! <laughs> this is gonna turn into a penalty simulator video. I literally, the lowest amount of power. Yes! Let's go! Plus five! Let's freaking go! 15 rated after this game. Maybe I can get another one. No way, bro. I. Okay. 52nd minute. This could take me to a 20 rating. Mokoko, it's your time to shine. 20, 20, 20. Oh, that's more than perfect, right? Yes! <laughs> Lowest amount of power. It is Mokoko time. 20 rating. Oh, the Australian League is being way too kind to us. Get him. Central Coast Mariners for the third game of the season. And now Mokoko being 20 rated. Let's see how he feels. Come on, then. Show me some nice moves, shall we? Let's show the fans. Oh, look at those non-existent stepovers. I did some stepovers. Nothing happened. And you know what, guys? We're going to do it this way. A goal or an assist can also be utilized to upgrade skill moves and weak foot, okay? So if we get a goal or an assist, we can go for that part of the game as well. Beautiful. <laughs> assist. I love the Australian League. Get in. Mukoko is on fire. 25 rating. Primed moment for Mukoko. Oh, that might not be good. I might hit the crossbar. <laughs> oh, my. Let's not talk about it. The game is done. Up to a 25. I've gone basically all into pace. All my skill points I've put into pace to keep him at that 25 rating. But that's the way to go for me right now. I need him to be able to get past people. And 60 is way better than what we had a second ago. So let's go into the fourth game of the season. Fourth game of the season. Mukoko could be through. This 60 pace could pay off right here, right now. This is the time to shine. Can I score? Oh my God. I can't. Oh, okay. So focusing on pace definitely wasn't the right choice. Our last game in Australia against one of the worst teams in the league. Could this be the time for Mukoko to step up? If I can get another game with two goal contributions, that's it, bro. Mukoko, sprint through, pal. Yes, that's the moment. Fifth minute. The control is okay. The shot is better. Ah, yes. This feels like winning the lottery every time I score. I can't believe it's happening. This is all an ultimate difficulty, bro. What the hell is going on? This is incredible. 30 rated now. That game ends our journey in Australia. The question is, where will we now go as a 30 rated player? The Chinese league is calling. Dalian is the club we're joining. Mukoko seems very happy. It's me and, uh, me and himself joining this club now 300,000 they had to pay for him 
Let's make that money worth it. Up top, he comes in now to play at least five games we're going to jump into with him. And ideally, this season, I am hoping to get up to at least a 45. It has to happen. And once we get there, I think we can go up very, very quickly. So the first and tough part of this video could finish with this season if I do things right, which I probably won't. The fun thing in this league is that some players are just above the 50 rating. So if we could potentially get four goal contributions, we're right up there with the rest of the league which makes us a lot more competitive. First game, first penalty. Oh, yes. We can do this. We have done this so many times before. Can we do it again? Yes. <laughs> this feels like cheating, but I don't care. Lovely. Yes, please. Oh, two goals in one game. Nah, you're joking, bro. I could go up to a 45. We have gone from 30 to 40 already. They keep giving me penalties. Can I keep scoring them? Oh, there's a little bit more power on this one. Oh, he literally stands in the middle. <laughs> it's okay. We have gotten two upgrades up to 40 and a lot more competitive already. On this specific upgrade, I have gone for power, the shooting, and of course, a little bit the ability to stay calm in front of goal. Hopefully, all of this will do well. This could be the one. I have a player to my right. If he comes with me, we're going to score this. Go with me, pal. The assist is for you. Come on. <sighs> yes. 45 rating. Only one more. And then we go up to a 50, which means we only get plus threes after that, right? So let's focus. There he is. Left footer. Bang. <sighs> one day, one day I will score one of those. We take one upgrade out of this game. For this specific upgrade, I've gone into agility balance because he feels clunky as hell, but still a 45. Oh, cool, cool. Through on goal. The other guy's fast too. Oh my God, one star weak foot. Oh, <laughs> I need to upgrade that badly. Lots of space. Do I cross? I guess I do cross. Absolutely no way. That we have just gone ahead and scored a header. I must be dreaming. Fourth game, Beijing, 50 rated. Mukoko has been upgraded in dribbling and in finishing. Yes, I like that. Mukoko in the center. Let's see that finishing. Oh my lord. On the right foot, there is no finishing. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Am I three on goal? Please, please. I also upgraded his pace. I, I upped it to like 75. Come on. No. Uh, no. Make a run for me. Make a run for me. Yes. Stop. Cutting. Smack it. I can't. Mate. I'm actually hitting target now, but not scoring. Fifth game coming. Lovely. Nice one, two. Back into the center. Over. Once again. There's Mukoko. Lots of space. He can now do that. He can now do that. What the hell was that? And that, my friends, is the end of our journey over here in China. It is time to move on to a different league. I want to go back to Europe. It is a snowy place that we have joined and a team with the black and yellow. Mialbi EF. We are now in Sweden. Let's begin the journey. We're going to play in a two-striker formation up top with Mukoko. He's 53 rated. Everyone around him in this team is above 60. So there's a long way to go up. Mokoko making his run. Gets the ball. Brings it back. Smack. Yes. Yes. 56 rating. Come on. Our second game in Sweden is beginning. And Mokoko has a chance to go upwards from 56. I need him above a 65 by the end of the season. That would be ideal. Mokoko gets the ball. Turns back. Finds his teammate. Smacks it. I love it. I am turning into a true maestro assists for Mukoko as I continue to improve his finishing. He keeps on getting assists. Now 59 rated, I have specifically gone after the composure stat. I don't want to fail in front of goal again. Third game in Sweden, kick it off. Penalty, my favorite. Oh, you know what? I should probably upgrade Mukoko's penalty uh, ability next time around because he's still absolutely awful at it. 
But can he score this in Sweden? First penalty. Yes. Third game done. Another upgrade. 62. We're getting to the same level as the players around us. Sundval is our next opponent. I'm ready. Penalty. I've worked on the penalties. Guys, he now has... I will show you. He has 80 penalties. Hell yeah. Let's smack this in. Top left. <laughs> yes. 65 ratings. Walking out to our last game in Sweden. A country that has been really good to us. Can I get some more upgrades before we leave? Can I go up to 70 possibly? Could this be the 1v1 situation that I need? It is. Yes. Finishing upgraded and it works straight away. Oh, mate. This is such a freaking journey. I am loving it. This is exactly what I wanted to finish off the season. Yeah! It's the black and yellow. He's being left with a great performance. Two plus three upgrades for the main man himself. He's on fire. And once we get to the 80s, as you guys know, we go by plus ones. But this has been sick. What is the next club of Mukoko, though? Mukoko joins a Serie B side in Benevento. I want to try and help this team achieve success and go up into the Serie A. That is the big target that we're gonna give that we're gonna give ourselves. But obviously, I only have control over five games, so let's see how it goes in the Serie B. Can Mukoko be the guy starting off with not a 72, but? A 71. Serie B, here we are. Palermo as the opponent. Definitely a team that I want to rebuild at some point throughout this year, by the way. And I am currently watching Bayern Munich playing at home and losing against Kern, who have beaten their last opponents with seven goals. Could Bayern be the next team to suffer here? Moncini is through. Mukoko is going with me. Mukoko, keep sprinting. Keep sprinting, young man. Smack it. Oh, I need to work on his weak foot. 52nd. What a ball. Mukoko. He goes through. And he doesn't score. What? Yes, he scores. Kind of forced, I know. First game in the Serie B. Won the lead to Benevento. And then across to the far post. Mukoko against two. Wow. Hey, I'm getting better at heading the ball. First game was a good one, but we lost 2-1. Mukoko now with the 74 rating. He is out there and up there with some of the highest rated players in the team. Viviani is the last one that he needs to surpass and then he's officially the one. 77 is the next step and look at that. 96 pace, 73 shooting, 85 dribbling. Definitely though, I need to work on a weak foot. Our second game in Italy has just begun. Benevento against Bari in the center. Mukoko finds his teammate. What a horrible pass. And there he is. Yes. Get in. <laughs> Have you lost your mind? The Benevento fans are very happy with their new boy. He is stepping in and scoring. Just one upgrade per game, though. I would like to pick up two. So far, Benevento in the sixth position, by the way. As a 77 rated player, he is now the highest rated player in the team. I've gone all into mentality in this one. Yes. Give it to me. 29th. All right, this is to become an 80 rated player. From that point on, it's only plus ones. Mokoko, top right. Golasso. As I said, from now on, only plus ones. Only two games left for us in Italy. Benevento, I'm trying my best, but the team is struggling at the moment. Dropped down massively in the league table and a voice crack is included. Yes. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. We have the position of dreams. Inside is one man and one man only. And he will not miss. 1-1 one, one. gets in. That is only a plus one upgrade. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to upgrade his weak foot. Now he will have a two-star weak foot. That last match ended as a draw. But here we are. A win could put us back into the playoff positions. It is the last one that we get into with Benevento, and it could straight away be a goal against Zutirol at home for a left footer. This is perfect. Going for the far side, Mukoko, aren't we? This is going to be a banger. Bang. Yes. 
Another upgrade. Another one. And I'm going to go for the weak foot again. Hold up, though. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. We could make it two. We could make it two. Please don't be sprinting forward. Go, go, go. Go on. Show me that two-star weak foot. <laughs> it will be a three-star after this one. Oh, we're preparing ourselves. A big move is incoming. I don't know where I'm going, but I'm feeling it. Last game for Benevento. I'd be surprised if they can go ahead and get it done. But at least we have gone up to a three-star weak foot 80 rated player this season. Actually, you know what? We already had two stars, so I'm going to go three-star weak foot, two-star skill moves. And sadly, for the first time where we actually cared about doing well, we failed. Top eight gets, gets playoffs. We finished 10th. A move is coming for Mokoko. AS Monaco. Yes, the team that has made Mbappe basically, right? He moved from Monaco to PSG. And now we're going to go the same path. A league uh going to be competing against some of the best players in the world, which is going to be great amounts of experience for him. And he will be replacing the likes of Kevin Folland in the starting 11. The rest of the team is obviously very much capable. A great stri striking partner in Mbolo. And possibly some others as well with Lucas Nemecha and other signings sat here on the bench. Traore, Vicario, Estupinian. This is the team for our boy. Lille is going to be the first opponent for Mukoko at AS Monaco. Funny thing is, I'm literally right now watching Mukoko as I'm recording. Oh my god, what the hell just happened there? I am actually watching Dortmund versus Mainz as I'm recording this. And this could be a goal. Hold up. There he goes. Mukoko. Go on. Smack it. Yes. We score. 40 second minute. It's the first time in the league uh, that he is managing to score. 60th minute in the actual Dortmund game. I think Mokoko is about to get subbed off for Haller, who has surpassed the threat of cancer, which is amazing to see. For that goal right there, we are going with the skill move upgrade. Three star, three star now on our boy. As we go into the game against Olympique Lyon, we are actually top of the league. Yes, this could be the first time we managed to win a trophy, a big trophy with Mokoko. Lads, this is our chance. Let's keep winning. This could be it. I need at least one upgrade out of this game, man. 82 or 81 rating, I should say. One on one. Not going to miss that. Of course not. He is doing well in the red and white. As an 81 rated player now. Yes, I've finally gone for a rating upgrade. We are stepping up against Olympique Marseille. I've made it my mission to play against some of the top sides in France to give ourselves a proper test of the abilities of Mukoko. For Fana. Chare. Mukoko. Yes. I made him run downwards for this moment. And this moment only. Stepping up against the big ones. I told you. That's what I want. And he does it over and over again. I want two out of this game. Come on. Let's make it happen. Let's move that straight away. 45th. Bang. 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 Yes. Two, baby. Get it. Hey, you know what? We take the 2-2-1 two. Two, against Olympique Marseille. AS Monaco. Can we actually go ahead and win the title? Ici c'est Paris. But it is time for us to step onto this pitch and take everything away from Mbappe. The new Monaco wonder kid is here to take over. Penalty. That is his expertise. Worked on this for years. He was awful at it. But now... He's one of the best in world football. And he goes straight down the center. Mukoko against Mbappe. This is our boy on his journey to become the best. Incredible. We started off at one overall and now we're scoring at Parc de France. This is sick. We had that one chance and PSG end up beating us 2-1. I have one more game to play in France. I'll play the second game against PSG. Just a quick little update on the boy. 84 rated now, 96 pace, 84 shooting, 86 dribbling. He is getting there. I will make this guy a 90 plus rated player for sure before we get to that Champions League final. Also, here's the league table. AS Monaco after 36 games. Now in the second position, we are helping this club to qualify for Champions League football. But I do... Want my revenge from PSG. Hold on. 67th minute. 
I do have the option of passing it here, but I will take it away from the defenders. Sprint and smack it toppings. It's 2-1 for PSG though. Oh, okay. That takes us to an 85, but hopefully get another chance. No. Oh my God, bro. No chance. Wow. Okay. There's levels to this game. We need to get to a better squad. AS Monaco story with Mukoko is sadly done. He might be sad, but we have to move on into the next part of his career to get onto the same level as that guy right there. A big star is walking towards his next club. Barcelona was needing a striker and I was happy to oblige. I needed to see Mukoko in that Barcelona kit. I want to take this team back to Champions League glory. And along with that, obviously, build upon Yusufa Mukoko. And let's be real, how good does that look? Mukoko, number nine, Barcelona. We're making those pictures for the history of the club because I will be lifting so many trophies with this guy. But most especially, the biggest one of them all. Let's pick up that Champions League trophy. The team our boy will be playing for is looking like this. Mukoko in front of Bernardo Silva de Jong and Pedri, both above 90. Incredible stuff. Torres on the left, Rafinha on the right. Fourth right back, Kunde, centre back, Vardiol, left back, uh, left centre back, I should say, Vanderson in that left back position. And then we have a couple of beasts on the bench, Pepe, Diop, a couple of good ones, lads. It is looking good for us. Mokoko has a lot of support. Stepping into action for the team, we're going to be playing in the Champions League. Juventus currently ahead of Barcelona. I only get to play five matches, so I got to. Hope that the team performs while I am not in there, but hopefully the fifth game of the season is going to be a Champions League final. The time has finally come for us to step into this glorious competition. Juventus, I'm sorry, but I have to ruin you. Juve already has a goal as we go into this game, which isn't necessarily ideal. Mokoko makes a move, plays the ball, asks for it to come back to him. It might find its way back to him somehow. And it does. <laughs> I'll take it. It's dodgy. It's 1-1. One, one. Keep it up. There he is again. <laughs> it's not his goal, but it's okay. It's 2-1. It's a 2-2 two, two draw in the end against Juventus. I mean, it's a bit underwhelming, I have to admit. Our next opponent in the Champions League is... Uh, Bayern Munich, and it is the round of 16, a huge match. I need to do well and put ourselves into a great position so that our team can do well in the second leg without me. KDB at Bayern. Oh, mate, that'd be a dream. Is that my ball? 49th? Oh, yes. Give me these types of chances all day in the Champions League. I'm going to be the nice guy. <laughs> Easy goal. Sweaty goal. Barcelona is leading against Bayern Munich. That's all I wanted to see, lads. Rafinha, we get the assist and a plus one. Well, this one's sealed. 1-0 victory. I'm hoping the team can do well without me. Because <laughs> I want to step in the, the quarterfinal. Let's see if it worked. We have gotten past Bayern Munich with a 3-2 victory to now play against Vinicius Jr. and his friends. This is the moment I've been waiting for. Barca against Real Madrid. This could make him an absolute legend if he does go ahead and score in this. Solo run? Solo run? It is not a solo run. I have support. I have support. Ferran Torres? Are you freaking kidding me, Ferran Torres? You can't be for real. How did you not score that? Mokoko finds Rafinha. Back inside. One more. And yes! It's beautiful. He scores against Real Madrid. You couldn't write it better than that. My man is doing it on the biggest stage. That will take him to an 87 rating as well, by the way. And the game finishes 1-0. It is the perfect setup for the team to do well in the second match and get us into the semifinals. I hope they pull it off. Guys, it is actually an upgrade to an 88 by now. 96 pace, 91 shooting, 93 dribbling. I love it. I want him to be 90 plus though. That is very important to me. And hopefully that will happen. And also 
We have beaten our opponents in the simulation. Real Madrid has been beaten 2-1. And that takes us into a game with Atletico Madrid in the semi-finals. And against Atleti, we only get a chance given from a free kick at first. Ferran Torres looking for the main man. Oh, did you see him rise like a freaking salmon? <laughs> what a jump. He actually has 90 plus jumping at this point. He could get this ball. He could get this ball and he will. And he's looking for his teammate. He finds him. Gets the assist. Barcelona. Mukoko to an 89. Ferran Torres with the goal. And we are leading in a semi-finals. Get in. The dream of lifting the trophy with him is getting closer. It actually ends 1-1. Now, this being my third game of the season, that puts me into a position where I can't risk it. I have to step into the second leg as well. So here's the deal. I pressed play match. Why are you the way that you are? And I played in like I would have played the entire match and I messed up because I wanted to play the highlights. So to not cheat, I press jump to the results. I hate so much about the things that you choose to be. You guys, the Lord has saved me. We have gotten through 4-3 on aggregate. It was a close one. Apparently, Mukoko scored in the 59th minute. Kunde scored in the 36th and Ferran Torres in the 82nd. I got so lucky on this one. I will take it any day. And that means we now play the Champions League final straight away. This could have cost me everything, but I got so lucky. So let's dive into the final. The team might be in the Champions League final, but it also means that there's a chance for us to grab the double. FC Barcelona, 88 points. Mukoko has helped lead this team to this big trophy. And now I want the biggest one of them all. Let's get the double. Full focus on this moment and this one only inter against barcelona guys i am hoping that i can have that magical moment with our number nine the man who has traveled the world going to different clubs to china going to sweden just working as hard as he could to get to this stage and now might be his time the ball into him straight away mukoko sees his teammate make a run great ball inside Get it back to him. Left foot. Too many defenders. Left foot. No defenders. <laughs> yes. Yes. Celebrate. Celebrate, young man. Because you are the hero of FC Barcelona. Your career will be talked about for years. Start it from the bottom. Now we're here. Rafinha with Mukoko and Ferran Torres in support, possibly. Rafinha. Rafinha cuts in front of the defender, sees Mukoko, he sees the short, the short angle to the near post, 61st, come on then lads, we have fourth on the ball and a runner down the right wing, I see it, it is going to be Rafinha, Inter could score any moment, I need to utilize every single chance I get, good ball, Mukoko, can he find his teammate, shot, and he comes off the post. Number 11, Ferran Torres. That right there would take Mukoko to the 90 rating, by the way. We started off as an 88, and now with the two goal contribution, that is the 90. 87, Inter have scored. I need to score because they could potentially come back with another one. Down the left wing. Beautiful. Into Ferran Torres. Mukoko, come with me. Come with me. There he is. There he is. It's done. It's finished. The Champions League final has been won. The journey is completed. Oh, mate. I needed this. I needed this badly. It, I recorded this video for two days now because it's such a long process to get done. You only get to see the smaller parts, but my God, lads. This was fun. Look at him stepping up to the stage, going along with his teammates. Ah, so many seasons, so many years. And now he is in front of that trophy. De Jong is the captain. I probably should have captained Mukoko just for the shot <laughs> of lifting the trophy. But lads, we'll take it anyways. He's right behind him. He is a part of this huge moment. 
And with that, guys, we're going to end it. Thank you so much for watching this one. If you have watched until the end, you are an absolute legend. I appreciate the hell out of you. And I will catch you on the next one when we try and go crazy once again. Take care. Follow your boy on Instagram, Johnny Sports. And peace.